This is a technique to help alleviate muscle tension in the lower back. So for this exercise, all you need is a lacrosse ball, or if you find the lacrosse ball a little too firm, a little too pokey, then use a tennis ball or something a little bit softer. But what you're gonna do is lay on the ground, and this is gonna work the muscles next to the spine and above the pelvis and below the ribs. So to find those areas, just reach back, rotate the legs to the side, and feel for the top part of your pelvis here. Now move your hand up until you get into the soft part of the lower back, so into the muscles. Now you don't want to push right on the spine either, so you want to just make sure you're in the muscles when you do this exercise. So with the lacrosse ball or massage ball, rotate the legs to the side, place it into the muscles next to the spine above the pelvis, and then center your body over the ball. Now you should feel a little bit of pressure when you start this exercise but to increase the pressure, because the muscles are, are very thick in this area of the body, that what you're gonna do is on the same side as the ball, you're going to bring that leg up, reach up, put your hands in front of the knee, and then pull your knee upward as far up as you can tolerate. So what happens here is as the knee is coming closer to your chest, the lower back actually will start flexing a little bit and flattening towards the ground. So then that increases the pressure from the ball. Now, you wanna go up, again, as, as far up as you can tolerate. So you wanna be able to keep the leg fully relaxed, keep your midsection nice and relaxed so that then the ball can, can do the job of massaging those muscles. So you're gonna hold this spot for about 30 seconds. Just take deep breaths while you're holding it. And then after 30 seconds, let the leg come back down rotate the legs to the side again, and then just move the ball up half an inch to an inch. And then you're gonna repeat that process. So stay nice and relaxed. Pull it up as far as you can go. Keep that midsection relaxed, keep the leg relaxed, hold it for 30 seconds. Now you're gonna do it on both sides of the spine. You can focus in on the areas that feel tighter or the side that you're having more symptoms on, that's totally fine. Just stay nice and relaxed, let the ball do the work. Now again, you just want to stay away from the bony parts of your back, and once you get up to where you start getting into the rib cage, that's high enough. So usually it's about three to five positions in the lower back on each side. So spend a few minutes a day doing this to help alleviate the tension there. One other thing to note is if you have any type of hip impingement or any hip irritation on the front here, just be cautious on how high you pull up. You don't want to feel pain or pressure in the front of your hip when you're doing this exercise. You can try different angles to try to clear that part of your hip if you do feel some of that discomfort in the front of the hip there.